everybody. So we're going to be talking about um, vaping tools. Um, we're going to be talking about um, the tools I have, tools I might have acquired, what things I find useful. Um, and also, shout out to um, Stephen Cox for you know the hat I'm wearing. Just get out and fix something. And a shout out to this guy's garage and 4IM caper. Um, for the shirt he sent me on the giveaway I won. So please stick around, check out the stuff I have for uh, Vapor Tools, and I'll see you guys next time. All right, everybody, how's it going? So we're gonna be talking about some Vape ink tools. This is a coil master kit that I picked up a while back. I put some vaping stickers on it, like Morg Juice, um, Banzaz Vapors Long Live Flavor. Um, I don't remember the the B, what their brand is. Um, I have it around here somewhere. Um, I also have a sticker. I don't know if it's still there on my wooden TV stand. Yep. Wake, vape, hustle, repeat. Um, public service announcement brought to you by Boardwalk Vapor, um, or Boardwalk, which is a brand, and that's the, the brand I couldn't think of. Um, so, this brand right here is actually Boardwalk with the two vapes, and so is the playing card, the sticker. It's a Boardwalk brand also. They have pretty good juice. I will probably do a video on juice also. So, open this kit up. I threw a little extras in here, you know, my cotton, stuff like that. The best cotton I've ever used is actually Cotton Bacon version 2.0 by Wiccan Vape. Um, this stuff is great. Um, I have gotten the, the cotton off of Amazon also. This is organic Japanese cotton. So I have a pair of side cutters in here, just generic ones I bought from the store which this kit also comes with side cutters. I put a little magnet in here. Um, a little Phillips screwdriver. And this is a 3.5 millimeter, 3 millimeter, 2.5 millimeter, 2 millimeter, and 1.5 millimeter um, coil tool. You wrap your coils around this depending on the thickness that you want. Um, and that thickness and how many wraps will depend on how many ohms you're looking for. So, I have a couple kits in here. Um, this is a coil wrapping tool. This is for um, ones, which would be a two millimeter. And then I have a three millimeter one also it's purple and you can adjust the screws to make it turn the coil a little easier or if you're looking for a tighter bunching um, I have this kit right here which you basically have um, I'll just move the camera over basically have these three this is a two millimeter my little kitten a three millimeter and a four millimeter and then it has the the little tools that you can wrap the coils with this is just makes life a little easier if you want to do it that way um, and then you basically it has a handle this is just a, a large coil master kit so it comes with one two three um, one, two, three, four, five, six different sizes. So, um, this one does four millimeter. This one does 
this one does three millimeter this one does 2.5 this one does two millimeter and 1.5 and then you basically just unthread this hand tool and you drop the size you want in you thread it back on and then you pick the corresponding one up and it fits just like that um, so this is a really nice kit I just happened to had bought um, the purple and the blue one first um, and then I ended up buying this kit and then I just put it in the kit um, it does come with a, a coil tester It also comes with a pair of foldable scissors. Which work pretty great. Um, I ended up throwing this in here. You can actually thread this to your mod. Your mod actually gives it power and it'll tell you the voltage. Um, and then you can thread your your RDA or your your tank on top of it to dial in the voltage and everything um, and this is a tool specifically used for this it's an extender it comes with a couple different pairs of tweezers coil master comes with a metal tip pair fine point it comes with one pair of ceramic tip which I have two in here I bought one pair separately from the kit which is this first one it's dark it's made by UD and then the kit came with a coil master set that I have not used yet um, Um, it also comes with a very nice red flathead screwdriver and it comes with a black Phillips coil master screwdriver precision set it comes with a pair of pliers pair of nice handle grip coated needle nose and it also comes with a pair of coil master um, small dykes so I've added a few things into the kit like um, these two blue and the purple coil wrappers I've added this tester and this adapter this adapter also works on this tester. Um, and I added, you know, this um, coil gapper for the inside of the coil into the kit separately. I added this little cheap power built Phillips screwdriver in here, um, a magnet, and another pair of snips. And I just leave, you know, a couple things of cotton in here to make my life a little easier. So this is this kit. I think this kit, when I bought it, I also have a little metal ruler in here. It goes up to... It's sixteenths of an inch. And then on the other side, it does... 64ths So it's a nice little metal ruler Just in case I need it um, It's a decent kit If you were looking to buy a, a kit to make your own coils, I would suggest the coil master kit You can get it at um, Valor Vapor. I also know you can get it at um, Red Star Vapor and kidney puncher um, I bought this one from kidney puncher so that's that 
and then I'll show you some more tools. This happened to come with my uh, a diaper bag I bought for one of my kids, and I just stole the little baggie out of it. So here's a very old pair of just Walmart brand needle nose pliers. Here is one of those. Um, this is a Willie's Farming Co. I don't remember where I got this. I think my dad gave this to me. But this is a little precision screwdriver that has bits in the back. I leave this in this pouch. And then this is a larger... Uh, this is a, a larger UD um, coil wrapper. And it's just got... It's got the got the tools inside it inside the pouch including an allen wrench so that's it's a nice little kit um, and this one it just has four different size holes on the front so you just pick the one out you need I usually leave these in the big bag and what I do if I'm going to go hang out at a store or a vape shop or something, I'll just take this red kit and I'll leave this in the truck or whatever with my bag. So there's that. Extra stuff that I have in here. This is another coil tester for ohms and voltage. Um, this one I like a lot. It's a lot more compact. It's a little more accurate. I don't know who makes this one. This one's also rechargeable. The other one is not. This is similar to the one that's in the bag. In the red and black bag. But this one you have to like slide open. You got to put batteries in it. And... So I like the rechargeable one the best. This one doesn't have any batteries in it. This is another pair of those uh, Fiskars Easy Action um, fabric shears. This is a new pair. The black ones I showed you earlier are very old. They're like 14 years old. These are about four years old. I've only used them like twice because I quit vaping right after I bought them. This is a little UD coil jig. Kit. I have a lot of these coil jigs. Um, I have the, the large one in here. I have the one that came in this master kit. The two blue and purple one I put in the master kit. And I have this one. So I've got about four or five of these coil jigs. That's the tools that are in that pocket. Put these back in here. Well, actually, I can leave them out. Um, and I have just a regular measuring tape for clothing in here, in case it's needed. These are just some extra springs that I had saved and some screws, which they don't need to be there. So these are basically the tools that I have that I have acquired for this stuff. This I actually acquired a long time ago for precision stuff on computers and then I ended up throwing it in that kit. This is actually, it's got a little magnifying glass. It's got a, a wobble extension um, and a bunch of bits. Um, and then it also, if you take it out, it's got an extension in here too. It's just a straight extension. So I thought it would be a good handy kit for my vape stuff. And then this kit, I 
think my wife randomly had this and then she gave it to me when we met a long time ago. So that's the basics of the tools that I have here. Um, if you have any questions, please go ahead and ask in the comments below. Please like, comment, subscribe, hit the bell notification icon, and check out my Amazon affiliate links. And also, the next video will be talking more about cotton. And then um, I'll tell you on the end of that video what, what we'll be talking about next. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys next time. And uh, y'all have a good day.